What is up guys, COD Gameplay here. In today's video, I am bringing you some gameplay from El Poyoko, one of my friends that I play with on a uh, pretty regular basis, and he is an absolute monster. In this gameplay, he ends up going 189 and 3. Yeah, that's right, 189 and 3. That is crazy. This guy is an absolute monster. And in this gameplay, I cut it into two parts. So the first part, he goes 90 and 1 in the first round. And the second part, he uh, has the rest of the game. But what I want to talk about in today's video, because, you know, I hit, I just hit 100,000 subscribers. And I was like, you know what? I think I have the authority to uh, help people on how to actually be, like, get a bigger channel. I'm always, always getting personal messages, tweets, everything saying, COG Gameplay, how exactly do you grow your channel? How do you get yourself bigger? How do you get yourself seen? And so, with that being said, I'm going to start out with the very, very basics, and then in the second part of the video, I'll go expand more, and then I'll probably have a third part where I expand even more. So starting off, if you want to get a large channel, you have to start off knowing that you can actually do it, okay? You have to realize that you have the time, you have the money, and you have the what what it takes to actually grow a YouTube channel to a large audience. So the first thing that you're going to be have to do is you're going to have to create an account. And now this account is what you're going to go by on YouTube. So do not do not make it childish. Do not have any numbers, preferably try to make it simple catchy something that people will remember and so they won't forget that is the biggest thing when you're starting out you want a channel name that is really really good so the channel name that i got was cod gameplay and i think that is pretty pretty good for people to remember i don't think people are going to forget anytime soon it doesn't have any numbers it isn't childish it isn't like smoke weed every day 420 uh xx pro snipers like you know what i mean it's got to be something that if you mature in five years will you still like your name one bad thing about my name i have to say i limited myself to only one franchise which is call of duty and i highly suggest trying not to do that try to have it something that you can bring over everything and it is simple catching all of that the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna have to create an email with that with that exact username because if you do get big you're gonna be imitated so what i did i went on twitter i went on twitch i went on uh yahoo facebook um everything that i could and took the name cod gameplay right when i started the worst thing that i did i didn't take cod gameplay gmail or hotmail and guess what happened both of those got took, taken after I hit like 10k subs on YouTube, and I completely forgot about that. That was one major mistake that I made. So I don't have those two emails, but I still do have accounts on almost basically every single website that I go on, and that I think people will go on, so I, I'm not imitated, because that is a huge thing when you're a large channel. The next thing you're going to have to do is uh, you're going to have to realize that you you cannot have the objective when you start to make money, okay? When you start out on YouTube, you have to do it solely for fun. And if you start out on YouTube and you're saying, okay, you know what? I'm going to make $500 a month. And that is the reason why I want to do gameplay commentary. Um, you're not going to get anywhere. Trust me, you're gonna, not going to have the motivation. Your content is going to be subpar. People will notice that you aren't actually doing it for fun. And they will start, no one will subscribe. It's, it's not how you should present your channel. You should present your channel as a way, a place that you always have fun because that is what you should be doing. The next thing you have to realize is that you have the time to make videos and you have to have realistic expectations with equipment and money. You have to have a good computer to render things. You have to have a good internet speed to upload, a good mic, and a good recording device. All of those things are super, super key. People will create channels and they have a 0.1 upload speed. Do not do that. People will create channels when they have a computer that can barely run any video games on it. Do not do that because what's going to happen, you're going to take four hours for an upload. No one wants to do that. You can't do anything on the internet when you have a four hour upload. And when you have a four hour render time, it is absolutely ridiculous rendering overnight and it's not enjoyable. Trust me, I've been there, done that. I had to upgrade my computer twice. I had to get a new internet twice. And just to keep up with YouTube and uh, growing a channel. Uh, the next thing, you have to make sure that you have something marketable, okay? Yeah, if you're going to have a, do commentaries, have the voice. Uh, don't be 12 years old and doing commentaries. No offense, no offense. Um, but you have to have a good enough voice that people will want to listen to you. And it's it's pretty soothing. Like, 
Pacific Tomb has a, a great voice. That guy has a, like a sick voice. Captain Sparkle, Sea Nanners, stuff like that. And if you're going to montages, be sure that you're a good player, okay? So anyways, this concludes part one. If you guys want to see part two, click that like button. When it hits maybe 500 likes, I will upload the next video. And I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys are brand new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button above. The person that got the gameplay is in the description. I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.